Looks like we, we've run through this. Uh, do we have any other business or anything that we need to discuss? Mr. Chairman, the board would have something to ask. If you don't mind. Yes, sir. Okay. Um, first, I have an offer for you. Well, first, um, Lyons County is all awesome know what the camera is about. And my hat, Lyons Area Knowledge Exchange, we record public meetings and put them on YouTube. So if you want to watch them back, you can feel like the meeting is twice as long than just sitting here. The other thing is, and my other hat is Swanee Riverkeeper. We do uh, paddle outings, amongst other things. And we got a bunch coming up. We'd like to invite you to, there's actually one that's not even on here, which is Saturday down at Swanee River State Park, 3 p.m. We're going to a place called Five Holes, which is a string of Springs and sinkholes. You can dive into one, come up at the next one. Do you have to bring your own boat? Uh, no boat for that one. No boat for that one. I mean, you can't if you want to. You can sit on the river, but that's not mainly what we're doing. And then the next day, Sunday, on the Withcoochee River at Georgia 122 Hagen Bridge, we're going to paddle down about six miles to uh, Franklinville, the old county seat. Should be a nice paddle. Looks like the river's up if it's not raining cats and dogs. And there's a couple more that are listed on here. Everywhere from uh, there down to uh, Manatee Springs. And we were last month going to start a thing called the Alapaha Quest way up at uh, Shibagi at the USA 2 in Barron County. But we had a slight issue that it had not rained, so there was no water. So we're going to try that again as soon as we think there's enough water. It's probably pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> so we'll get that scheduled pretty soon. I did, as she said, have a couple questions for you. Um, as you're aware, uh, George Power is trying to coal, close some coal plants, and they got all these coal ash ponds, and they want to ship it to local landfills. Now, um, our local landfill told Georgia EPD, Last year, they did not want any more of that, which is great. So I'm wondering what the opinion is on that this year, because naturally my opinion as a river people would be, could we, could we not do that? And I'd also like to find out, I know there is coal ash in there that came from TVA, because I got that from Georgia EPD. And numerous people have told me there's coal ash from JEA in Jacksonville and never been able to verify that. Um, if I could possibly find out what's in there and you know, get maybe some assurance that there's not going to be any more going in, that would be most excellent. Excellent. I know that, you know, being the Deep South Solid Regional Solid Waste Management Authority, we don't actually own the landfill in and of uh -huh. itself. Those would be questions for the current owner's advanced disposal, of course, you could, you know, Craig being a representative of them, I'm sure he'd be happy to take that, that up at some point in time and discuss that. Should I talk to you about that? Sure. All right. Thank you. Yes. Thank you, sir. Mm -hmm. Any other business? Craig, do you have any reports from the land? <coughs> well, everything going on? seems to be going, going well. And, um, I, I, I wanted to bring to the board the